What's up? Thanks for tuning in. We got another review here this afternoon. Feeling extra thirsty. Just housed an entire bag of the uh, the green bag of goldfish. I think it's Parmesan. Uh, it's really good though. It's uh, it's a good one. Leaves you very uh, thirsty though, right? Salty, salty but delicious. Uh, salty food, most salty food is pretty delicious. Uh, so we're gonna continue here. We got Hoot again. Uh, did the black cherry lemon already? This is a new pack, not the same variety pack, same flavors. New one. I needed another twelve. Uh, so I've, I've tried all of them at this point, but I had these and some polars and some Corona seltzers and some other random ones lying around the fridge. Don't really remember having the other ones, uh, but the black cherry lemon scored nice. Really, really good. I think it got a nine, fly nine. Not many, not many get up there. That's a, that's a high score. Uh, so we're gonna continue here now with the blood orange mango. Cool colors on these hoots by Night Shift uh, Brewing. Cool pack, nice uh, design. Again, it looks a lot like the Truly Lemonade colors. Um, the cans are their own thing though. They're out of this world, they're great. Uh, the other one was looking like Michigan Wolverines, Sea Wolverines, uh, that gold and purple one. Here we got like the throwback uh, Tampa Bay Bucks colors. You know what I'm saying? Tom Brady and Gronk down there now, down there in the uh, down there in the NFC South to to haunt uh, to haunt those teams. Uh, anyways, anyways, that's it. This ain't a football review. You do like football, but not here to talk about that. We're here to talk about the the Celtics. Uh, so again, stats on these, they're four percent flat. Not that's kind of its only detriment, the only downside to them. They're ninety calories, um, and it's very strange. They have a gram of fat. The only, not a big deal, but the only seltzer ever that I've seen uh, with that. Also, the only seltzer in the normal beer uh, can dimensions for the to fit the twelve ounces. So without further ado, nice sound there. Snap. Yeah, this is awesome. Just like the black cherry lemon. Um, this, this one's really good in terms of how light it is, drinkable, crisp. Doesn't really drink. Um, it drinks like a seltzer, a normal seltzer. It's almost like you don't even get the alcohol uh, flavor to it. So that's uh, that's really nice. It's nice and refreshing. Where is it at? Cup of ice, our bud. Again, another brimmer. Uh, yeah, blood orange mango. Expecting great things with uh, with cup of ice here. Just as good as the black cherry lemon, if not a little bit better. Even it's just so drinkable, so crisp. Uh, no other, no other seltzer really comes close. Polar would be uh, the runner-up, but honestly, uh, the bat one too, the little bit, the bat light ones too. Um, but yeah, Corona's not that bad either, but um, this is kind of second to none. It's in its own league in terms of that. Uh, the flavor's more subtle, but that's kind of nice. Gonna bump this up. Yes, one more notch on the belt, dog. We're gonna go with a 9.1 on this. The black cherry lemon had a nine flat. This is a nine one. Uh, so we've done two so far with the night shift brewing hoots, and both both are a nine or above. Um, so on average, if the other two flavors that we still have left go that way, this will be the highest rated pack um, by far uh, to date. So that's what it is, 9.1 Blood Orange Mango Hoot. Thanks all for watching. Pick these up if you see them, highly recommended. And uh, yeah, have yourselves a great day. See you next time.